Oh, don't just pull it, just pull it off. I don't know. So pull it? Yeah. Oh no. Oh. That is disgusting. For our final film in Sri Lanka, we're here at Nuala Elia station about to get the train to Ella. It is unfortunately not that nice a day <laughs> for those sweeping incredible views from the train, but it is what it is. Um, this train is scheduled for 12.30, which is in about 10 minutes, but we do not expect it to arrive then. Um, we will see when it actually does arrive because they are famously always late. quick easy train journey like we thought it would be. It was about three hours in total and now we are winding our way through the hills of Ella to get to our hotel. Hello! <laughs> welcome to Ella and welcome to the Lucky Star which is experiencing a power cut right now. So number one here's the dark bathroom. There is a shower sink and a toilet in there. So we got the official, this is what it's described at is in the hotel, the room with the best view. <laughs> so basically we have a really small cute little room but it's facing perfectly east, we have a balcony and we should be able to see sunrise from our bed. That's what we've been sold on and it was very cheap. First off a quick bed test, um, my lovely ornamental bed, very fun. Oh, it's very gentle, very plush. Yeah. Um, yeah. Then, let me just put my slippers back on. And then we have our wonderful balcony. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I really like my swinging chair. Um, so we are in Ella for three days. Um, it's basically this tiny little town surrounded by hills so all the hotels are up on the hills and it's definitely a backpacker town we saw lots of backpackers getting off the train with us and most of them are seeming to also be staying in this hotel I think booking.com is doing very well at promoting this hotel <laughs> it's still raining and misty so we can't quite see all of the view but it's okay because we are just going to chill we're gonna edit now and then we're getting a Sri Lankan rice and rice and curry dinner here at the hotel later tonight and then sunrise in the morning so like my socks and slippers combo with my little penguin <laughs> very Christmassy <laughs> right down that keep forgetting that it's near Christmas for those watching this in January I think it's one and a half weeks till Christmas so Merry Christmas <laughs> Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year.
side by side our fears are done All the good times just begun We know what we have, let's hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy, but things are finally right With you and I, the future is bright Today is just a bit of a chill day because the weather was not so good, although it's getting better now, which is nice. Um, we've come to Chill Cafe, which we read online is one of the best places to get some food and kind of relax and get a drink and a coffee. Um, so Seth's got a coffee, I've got some weird blue drink that apparently can solve all of your problems in your body. It's it improves eyes, hair, skin, also an aphrodisiac, antioxidant, anti-inflammatory, antidepressant, anti-anxiety, and so much more. So there you have it. It does everything. <laughs> wow. Another reason why we're here is um, our hotel had another power cut, so no power, no Wi-Fi, and we have to upload a video. So we're here stealing some Wi-Fi. Things we do for YouTube. Mainly so I could get a coffee. That was my main uh, motivation. It's, it's been very difficult finding good coffee in Sri Lanka. It's not like Thailand. Thailand, I was overflowing with good coffee. Here, quite difficult. But this is delicious. This morning we're starting the little hike to Little Adam's Peak, apparently the best sunrise here. However, we don't know if the sun's coming out. <laughs> so we'll find out this is a pointless errand or not very shortly. <laughs> Looks like we have some dogs for the journey. Come on doggies. Come on guys, show us the way. Dogs are literally leading us the way, it's so cute. <laughs> oh boy, a little drop here. <laughs> you want to lead the way, boy, if you're going to go there? Okay, sorry, it's very windy and dark, so I don't know if this is going to work, but we are at the top, ready to watch sunset. Little Adam's Peak actually has three peaks. A lot of people go to the first one. We decided to go to the second one. There is a third one, but we could not figure out like where where the path was. It's very, it's still really dark, um, and it's very overgrown. So we've set up camp. Oh, you can't see. Well, sat on a rock. He, <laughs> um, ready to watch what might be a bit of a sunset. It is very cloudy. Sorry, <laughs> sunrise. Ah, oh, I'm so excited for bed already. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, there might not be a sunrise, guys. Um, the dogs came with us the whole way apart and then left us right at the end. To be honest, 
the highlight has definitely been the dogs. This lovely little girl, this lovely little boy, who we're going to try and now adopt forever. This girl is, however, very defensive against this dog. She doesn't like him, so we're protecting her. Enjoy this for a little bit longer, and then we'll head to Nanach Bridge. It's time to go. Okay. So this route was fine until the last two minutes of the trail, and now it's so slippy. Here she comes. Go <laughs> Oh, do I just put it, just put it off? I don't know! Do I pull it? Yeah. Oh no! Oh! Is there another one? Oh! <laughs> Don't worry. Oh, that's so good! Oh, get it off! Wait, is that another one? That's another one! Are you okay? <laughs> I didn't check my legs for leeches yet. <laughs> oh my goodness. That is disgusting. Are you okay? <laughs> Oh, that's just such a shock. Sri Lankan Sri Lankan medicine. Wow. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Brilliant. <laughs> so, we had like vague recollections of reading somewhere that you take leeches, you shouldn't just pull leeches off, you should have salient water and get them off that way. Obviously, in our panic, we just pulled them off. Um, but what happens is it just keeps bleeding. <laughs> so that's why my lovely Sri Lankan friends um, told me what to do. Unfortunately, we have no, we have no tissues, we have no plasters, we have nothing. So, just sit here and press. It's a lovely view, so it's okay. What a beautiful sight. Amazing bridge. It's so fun that you can just kind of walk across it and snap away pictures and stuff and it's a beautiful background. Nice time chatting to our German and Dutch and Angolan friends. And now <laughs> Steph is hungry. So let's get some food. So we have completed all our activities and it's 20 past nine in the morning. <laughs> so uh, we're back at a cafe, we're gonna get a really big breakfast, kick back and relax with our new dog friend. We have another dog friend to introduce you. This is called Table Dog. And there's my lychee foot. <laughs> it's still bleeding, so. But a lovely South African man gave me some tissue and, and some plastic bands, so. Instead of that, I want the uh... So after a few days in Ella, we are back on the road. We are now making the two to three hour journey to our first national park in Sri Lanka. We're off to Yala. Yala. 